What do popcorn and politics, cookies and the Cold War all have in common? They are all a part of the Free Foreign Film Festival here at Brookdale. Hi, I'm Crystal Brockington, and welcome to Brookdale Newsmakers. Today's guest is ESL and Spanish professor Alex Idavoy. Hi Alex, thank you for joining us. Thanks for having me. So could you tell us, what exactly is the Free Foreign Film Festival? It's the Free Foreign Film Festival. Um, it's an attempt to bring foreign films to Brookdale, you know, to students as well as the, the, uh, the Monmouth County community for free. Now, how did this come about? Uh, it started in uh, 2002, I believe, as part of the, the International Film, um, International Center's uh, Festival. And we did four movies in one month. And it was, uh, it was so popular, um, but almost, it was almost too much. that the next year, I was asked by Emily Hagedorn, the director at the time, to spread it out. And what we ended up doing is having three movies uh, per semester. And that's been the case uh, pretty much ever since. So who runs the Foreign Film Festival? Who runs it? It's through the International Center. Um, but I'm the one that, that chooses the movies. Um, and um, I'm not given any sort of, you know, there are no restrictions or, or anything. Um, I get to choose them. And, and, and the way I choose them is I make sure that I cover different languages in different parts of the world. Um, is there anything else that goes into a movie? When you're thinking of showing it? Um, I try to show movies that are worth coming you know, out to Brookdale to see, so movies that are visually you know, impactful, but also movies that, that really challenge um, our, our way of thinking or expose us to a whole other uh, point of view, another way of, of telling a story, um, maybe covers a, 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 you know, a historical period in, in, a, in an impactful way. Um, because what part of, part of the, 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 uh, the series of the festival is that afterwards we have a discussion. And that's, that's really the best part of it. I get to host um, um, a discussion for anyone who wants to stay. So it's less about the movie and more about the impact that the film makes. Um, I mean, you know, I, th I, think, I think people that, that are interested in a foreign film are interested in seeing something that they may not, they're not, obviously not going to see on American television. They're not going to see at a regular uh, movie. Um, so I think you're already coming with a certain openness. Um, you, you know, there are certain students that show up because they're encouraged by, by teachers. Um, you know, yours truly is one of them to go it and, and, and just, you know, sit through this movie, see what, what you think of it. Um, so that, you know, you're coming with, with a certain openness and kind of, you know, anticipation of, of being exposed to something you hadn't seen before. Who can come to foreign film? Anybody. It's totally open to, uh, to the, the community. There's no you know, checking your IDs or, you know, students get paid one price. and No, it, it's open to anybody. I know my classes, I tell students, you know, bring your friends and your neighbors and, you know, whoever you want. Um, so so it's, open, it's open to anyone in the community. Can you give an example of a type of movie that you've shown in the past or that you plan um, to show in the future? At this point, uh, I think I've counted, that. I think I've shown somewhere between 25 and 30 films. Um, movies that I've shown. I've shown Emily, you know, a, a, a kind of a what I call fluff, uh, you know, French film, which is you know purely entertainment and, and just a great movie to watch. I've shown some really controversial movies like Battle of Algiers, um, which um, I've shown the, uh, the documentary Control Room, which tells how Al Jazeera saw the war in Iraq, which was very controversial. Um, fascinating discussion afterwards. Um, in fact, someone in the military came up to me afterwards and and kind of commented that he was there from the military. Um, and uh, thought that the movie was fair and that the discussion was fair afterwards. Um, and the turnout for that was, was huge. Um, you know, I've shown movies, um, you know, at one year around Thanksgiving time, I showed Babette's Feast, which is, you know, one of the great uh, food movies. So, it, you know, it, it depends. I've sh I showed a movie about Lumumba. Um, so it, it's, it's all over the place. Well, it's very interesting, but that was all the time we have for today. Thank you very much for joining us. Today's guest was Brookdale's ESL and Spanish professor, Alex Idavoy. For more information or to watch us on demand, log on to brookdalecc.edu. I'm Crystal Brockington. Thanks for watching.